Yo, Cam, you got a package, bro. Good looking, bro. Thank you. Alright y'all, so we got a package today from Universal Barber. So uh, let's open it up. Ooh, the rose gold FX trimmer. Alright, what y'all know about this, bro? Open it up. These things is clean, bro. These things is clean. Sheesh. Rose gold blade. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. These things is clean. Now, look, I gotta show y'all something. Look. Alright, so as you guys know, this is what I've been waiting for. I wanted both of these. Talking about the company, I like their products, okay? When I use these clippers, the cut get done faster and it looks good at the same time to me, I guess. These are the tools that I'm most comfortable with, so I got the matching trimmers. So I got the rose gold effects trimmers and the gold effects trimmers. Then I got the rose gold effects clippers and the gold effects. In this video, I did a mid fade. This is old. All the videos y'all seen is old that I've been recorded. Came out real dope. Dope edits at the end. Okay, I'm trying to step my edit game up just so y'all can watch it all the way to the end. But uh, yeah, y'all just stay tuned. It's gonna get crazy. Yo. Today we're doing a mid fade tutorial and I'm going to go in detail on how to use a razor on the lineup, okay? And the first thing you're going to do, you're going to start off our bald line before we cut the hair down. After you set the ball line, we're gonna go up with the lever open a full inch. Okay, gonna widen this guideline because we want this we want this blend to be stretched out, but we want it to be real bright at the bottom as well. guard open we're just going to debulk and get whatever's at the top because we're cutting the top with the one guard closed um the one guard open is really just debulking whatever is at the top Zero guard closed in a flick out motion using your corners, get rid of that middle line. using the lever open just to clean up with the zero guard lift out. Now 
I'll deliver clothes. We're going to get rid of that bottom line using the corners of the blade. Now it's still a little bit of the ball line at the bottom, so we're just gonna use my curlers and the T outliners and using my corners, I'm gonna get rid of some of the ball line. Now that the fade is basically done, we're gonna knock the hair down using the one guy clothes with the green. Now, I, I tell y'all this in every video, okay? I always spray hairspray on the lineup before I line it up, and I use a soft brush until it get dry. Okay, now we have the razor part, okay? When using a razor, first thing you wanna make sure you, that you are doing is stretch, stretching the skin out, okay? If you are not stretching the skin, you're gonna cut them, that's, that's for sure. So make sure you stretch the skin, okay? As long as you stretch the skin and um, move the blade towards the hairline in a slow motion, you shouldn't cut them, okay? Unless you're going way too fast and you don't know how to do it, that's the only way you should be able to cut them. But as long as you go slow, as long as you make sure you stretch the skin when doing this, you should be perfectly fine. guys this is the cut nice crispy line if you like it give it a like comment what you think subscribe if you're new it's your boy wavy kid calf follow me on instagram at wavy kid underscore calf but uh it's your boy wavy kid calf i'm out deuces